Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to answer the question of who has the best harpsichord on any virtual instrument or keyboard. I've tried a lot over the years. I already know the answer to this question, but your opinion might differ from mine. So I'm going to show you guys what I think is, well, I'll show you first one that I think is uh, representative of most of the bad ones I've come across uh, over the years. And then I'm gonna show you a, a few of uh, the best ones that I've come across so far. I'm sure there's other ones out there that are also really good, but uh, these are just the ones that I kind of have on me at the moment and the ones that I know of. So that's what we're gonna see. But before we get started, if you could please hit that subscribe button and that like button, it'll really help me uh, get this channel rolling. So with that, let's get into it. So as you can see, I already have them set up in the session. We have the Core Kronos, Contact, Helion 6, a Rolling Cloud SRX Orchestra, and the newest Rolling Cloud uh, virtual instrument, Xenology. So what I'm going to do is actually record all of them at the same time, and then we're going to listen back to them all separately. So now that we've heard all of them, I'm curious to know what you guys think is the best one. Personally, I like the SRX Orchestra the most. I've actually used that as my main harpsichord sound since, um, well, since I first started, basically, since I got the, uh, the Roland JV-1080 over there. When you uh, put the orchestral expansion in it, it's that exact same harpsichord sound. I think most people would agree that the Kronos is definitely the weakest of the bunch because it doesn't really sound like a harpsichord. It kind of does. It's like somewhere in between a clave and a harpsichord. I think the Contact one is probably my second favorite and that one comes with the library when you buy Contact. So the factory library that comes with Contact, that harpsichord's in there, which I think is pretty cool. And I can definitely see myself using it if I didn't want to use the Roland one and I wanted to have a harpsichord with like another different kind of sound to it. The Helion 6 one's probably my next favorite after that. Kind of similar to the Contact one. Just doesn't sound as much like a real harpsichord. And the Xenology one, I don't know kind of where to put it because it actually sounds very similar to the SRX Orchestra one, but it's just too dry, I guess. I mean, you could add reverb to uh, fix that problem, but I didn't want to touch any of these sounds or edit them in any way. I just wanted to load them like the preset as you get it so you can hear exactly what it is. And uh, the, yeah, the Xenology one is just really dry. And I, I guess like that is representative of like a harpsichord if you're in like a room that's very dry, but most people don't play acoustic instruments like that in dry rooms, so. At the end of the video, I'll have a playthrough of the entire harpsichord piece that I played there, but just using the SRX Orchestra, for those of you who want to hear that entire piece with just one uninterrupted harpsichord sound. And that's it for this video. Pretty simple one, one I've wanted to make for a while. I'm known in some circles as like the harpsichord guy. And uh, I mean, I like my harpsichords, what can I say? I don't get to use them as often as I would like, but when I'm playing like classical stuff or like Baroque stuff, uh, it's very important to get like the proper sounding harpsichord. And I didn't really find anything out there on the internet that really did a good job of like showing off like the best harpsichords out there and your options. And so this is just to help anybody who's like looking for a few different options in case they don't have one software or the other. There's a few here. It's really unfortunate that the Kronos happens to have a really bad harpsichord because it's one of my favorite keyboards. Very powerful keyboard with really horrible sounding harpsichord. But that just might be my opinion. You guys let me know if you disagree with me or if you agree with me. 
Or maybe you know of other harpsichords out there that are even better than all of these that I should check out. Please let me know. And with that, I'll play you guys out with that piece I just recorded, and I'll see you guys in the next video.